With the recent advances in technology, the multimedia arts have seen a spike in interest from students looking to get into the field. The Art Institute of Michigan is a multi-campus college of creative professional studies that provides quality programs and curricula that cultivates artistic growth for both young and older alike. The Institute recently held a graduate portfolio show that put a spotlight not only on the skills of its graduating students, but also on the artistic values of the college. Well, the portfolio show is the pinnacle of what the students present. It's That's them. They're a walking portfolio by the time that comes, and that's why it's the portfolio show. So this is their last step, and it's part of their graduation requirement, it's part of their education requirement, that they finish the portfolio show, complete the portfolio show, and in the meantime, they start working with our career service department. So career services then will, prior to this, run practice presentations before the portfolio show. Make sure their resume is the way it's supposed to be, professional and for their area. Um, they also uh, work with the student on their professionalism themselves. So it's not just strictly just presentation of their work, but how they present themselves. Very critical when they go out and start interviewing. Well, today is the Big Graduate Portfolio Show. Uh, the Portfolio Show happens um, every three months, so every quarter here at the school we have a Portfolio Show. It's for our graduates who are officially done. Today is their last day, and they are really showcasing their best of the best projects that they've worked on uh, during their time here at the school. So they are um, not only working on their projects or showcasing their projects, but they're putting together an awesome visual presentation as well, really highlighting um, their overall accomplishments of what they've achieved here at the school. The show, they're being judged um, for best in show and runner-up awards and then today later on this, uh, this afternoon actual uh, industry professionals and employers will be here along with family and friends. This is a public event um, but it really is a great platform for the students or for the graduates to connect and start building that relationship with networking with employers within the industry. It's kind of their first um, their first stop or first, you know, first branch out there uh, networking and marketing themselves as a, maybe a graphic designer, photographer, web designer, and it's a great way them to connect with employers in the industry. Creativity was unleashed at the recent Art Institute Graduate Portfolio Show. Outgoing students highlighted their artistic studies and their creative passions through various multimedia presentations. The class as a whole is uh, we had to um, combine all of our works from the past and kind of market and um, brand ourselves and in a way that employers would like to invest in us and in our work and hopefully see some potential in what we can do. I'm, I can do a layout design, uh, editorial design, illustrator, photoshop, any kind of drawing and sketching. As you can see here, this is uh, just some Sharpie work that I did on a guitar. Um, the book cover, which I have. Um, this is my portfolio book with my logo that I have made. What's your company called? Uh, Kona Designs. And then this is the logo just by itself. And then I also have some of the development of the logo to that point. The logo, what it would be on an actual product. And since I am so into music, and music is a form of art. I decided to make a mock magazine called Lucid Magazine. It's an entertainment magazine. It has to do with anything that's you know up and coming. Uh, we have the you know front page, and then along with you know table of contents, articles. This is um, a design that I made. It's off of, based off a of John Lennon quote, which is "A dream you dream by yourself is only a dream. A dream we dream together is reality." So as you can see, I have dream together reality and then inside the words are reality and dream because they are one and the same. The show highlighted how the school shapes students into multimedia professionals through its intense hands-on learning aesthetic. The faculty and the staff are amazing. They have been a huge uh, They've mentored the students from day one to you know today as an alumni and as a graduate uh, as a graduate at the portfolio show. They play instrumental role in student success here at the school. Everything from students or the faculty, uh, everything from teaching. The faculty also tutor. Um, the faculty come here uh, with a lot of hands-on and real-world experience. Um, a lot of our faculty have already worked in the industry, um, so bringing the industry experience to the classroom is so valuable for our students, um, just making them better prepared for their career in the industry. The last 28 years I've been in housing, 
and um, I also own a quilt shop, so I have a lot of love for fabric and sewing. Just kind of an offset of design. I just, I've always loved design in itself, so this kind of helped me refine my skills. Saw an ad on television, said to my husband one weekend, I'd like to go down for their open house. And the minute I walked in here, it was just like it was old home week. I felt so comfortable, and that's what prompted me to go here. In 10th grade, I will be honest with you, I was just there, really, I was just goofing off in high school. Like, 9th and 10th grade, I was not focused. I just, I just really came there to just really just have fun. And then I just decided, like, I need to get focused. So 11, by 11th grade, I really put on, I went in with clear head, um, focused, ready to, ready to learn, ready to get, get started because I knew I wanted to attend a decent college to make something of my life. Um, I, after two years, I, I, I graduated with my associate's degree in graphic design. Um, that, was, that was a journey. I came a long way because when I first started here, I didn't know anything about any of the programs or anything, so I was starting from scratch. A lot of people that attend here, they already knew the Adobe program, so it was easier for them. But I had to adapt, so I took up tutoring. I got um, started with that so that I would get the fundamentals down, so I could, like, the ideas I had in my head, I could display them on the screen, and that was most important for me, learning the program so I can create the work and do, do well in the classes. Really, for me, it was graduating. It was like my first graduation here just really felt good to say that, hey, I got my associate's degree in graphic design and I'm continuing on to better myself. The Art Institute of Michigan is unique in that it is part of a national consortium of degreed schools that puts students on a path of lifelong education. Well, the Art Institute of Michigan uh, is part of a, an, a larger group of art institutes, uh, which there's 51 in the United States. Actually, there's 50 in the United States and one in Vancouver, in Canada. So the Art Institutes and our campus is part of the Illinois Institute of Art. So there are some groups that are separated off by accreditation. And the Inst Illinois Institute of Art has six campuses in our region. There is the Chicago, downtown Chicago campus. There is the Schaumburg, Illinois campus. There's a Tinley Park campus. There is a Cincinnati, Ohio campus. And then there's the two campuses in Michigan. So um, we are an art and design college. We offer fine art degrees, associates and bachelors in various areas from fashion merchandising all the way through media arts and animation, digital photography, and culinary. Very passionate, very creative, um, a lot of energy, and our goal is to shape them into professionals, um, which I enjoy doing. To learn more about the Art Institute of Michigan, visit artinstitutes.edu.